Hi all folks, this is Max from ZetoMax.com and HTCEvoHacks.com So I've got the review of the Synergy ROM for the Evo 3D and the word around the town is that this ROM is the fastest, most stable with uh, the most features and it's absolutely the best ROM, you have to get this Anyway, I've got it uh, running at 1.728 You can actually overclock it to 1.8 GHz but um, uh, that's you know that's the maximum my phone can get to but it runs very stable I put it on performance just show you the uh, performance of this phone let me run quadrant test really quick for you uh, what I really like about this ROM see how fast the IO is going uh, it's based on extension 2 or 4 I think uh, instead of the NIFS uh, standard operating Android operating system which is a lot slower so that's why the phone runs like much quicker um, this is probably the, the fastest ROM out on the market right now complete with features there's a whole bunch of features you can do you can even do uh, you know uh, SSH, SSH and uh, let me see there's a whole bunch of list of options here um, oh let's look at the result first so I'm getting 3299 I was getting almost 3500 earlier um, anyway, those are really good numbers, and let me show you Limpack real quick. And uh, Limpack, I'm getting 86, very respectable numbers on Limpack. So 85, 86 at 1.90. Oh, Check that out, right? That's pretty good. 81. And let me give you a NeoCore test uh, real quick. It'll run. No, no, no. Oh, benchmark. There you go. Is that benchmark? Yeah. Um, so the benchmark's running. Let me turn down the sound. Um, this thing is just freaking awesome. Uh, it has a bunch of stuff. You can put all your apps on SD, but you have to, uh, but you have to uh, format your SD card as an extension uh, four. And there's a whole bunch of stuff. Um, let me point out the important ones. It has drop bear SSH, which means you can, if you know what SSH is, you can get shell access to the phone over Wi-Fi, over 3G or 4G. Um, so you can have your phone here and then you could, you know, log into it from Las Vegas or something. I don't know why you would do that, but, but it's still great for a developer. So I've got 58.6 for um, NeoCore and let me run a database test SQL RL this basically kind of tests the file IO system and uh, let's see what we get here uh, other things that include is um, it also has dynamic DNS support which means you know I had that video on how to make a uh, Android uh, security webcam that means you can install that on your phone and you can have it running on 3G or 4G and you could have the ultimate um, ultimate over the internet uh, webcam security system because these phones are great the battery lasts forever so even the the uh, let's say some burglar cuts your power off your phone's still running and it's running on 3G or 4G and it's you know you it's updating so that's kinda cool thing you can do with it I'm just telling you um, but I got 19.167 seconds. That's probably like unheard of on other phones. Um, so what else can I show you? Uh, it also has a. It also has this thing called um, config. Deconfig right here. If you go here, you can set up your um, SD card as uh, apps it, well you can put your apps in SD apps to SD you can enable that and there's even you can even move Dalvik to uh, SD if you get a really super fast uh, SD card that can improve the performance of your phone um, there's also page 2 um, there's a uh, move sense to you can ban sense unban sense uh, ban lock screen um, and there's a bunch of stuff you can do. You can do uh, and change the low mem killer. I guess if you set this high, it's it's your phone will run faster. 
Um, you can zip a line on boot, which kind of optimizes all your apps when it boots, makes your phone faster. You can change the Dolby Keep. Um, I set it to 72 megabytes. And also there's advanced tweaks you can do, sampling rate, uh, th threshold. Um, I'm not exactly sure what these are, but there's a ton of options that let you um, basically optimize your phone using different options. See, you can do the drop bear SSH I was talking about and dynamic DNS. I, I really love the dynamic DNS feature because I kind of tend to use that often. I was looking for that for it on my phone, um, but this one has it. I think there's a bunch of apps for it too, but whatever. There's also a user, there's a preset you can use. You can go performance, battery, um, and the apps it comes with. It comes with uh, all the standard apps you would probably find in a uh, in your phone. Um, it doesn't come with Sprint bloatware or Sprint TV. If you want to reinstall it, um, I think there's an app for it to reinstall. I'll have to go over that later. But this is a really nice ROM. I highly recommend you guys to uh, upgrade your 3D to this ROM. And also you can upgrade it really easily um, by going down to Synergy Updater and you can just update your ROM. You know once you install it. Anyway, go try it out. I think this is definitely, definitely the best ROM on the market right now. Go download it below and I'll have links on where you can donate to the original developer also. And uh, props Virus, Ziggy and Trev uh, for making this ROM. So this is freaking awesome ROM. This is what I've been looking for and finally found it. Um, go try it out. Let me know what you think. Alright, thanks y'all. Subscribe.